your rev match and uh, is on with the paddle. I'm going to have you guys switch positions real quick. I'm going to do Bronson first. Come on up, Bronson, because of the overheating that you had the last session, I want you to get your laps behind me right off the bat. There you go. Thanks, Mike. Mike, you shouldn't have a problem overheating with the, the Grand Sport there. Bronson, if it does get to, uh, you know, limp mode again or overheating, just, you know, back off and let it cool down. You'll be all right. Roger. We're just holding up for, for a minute here. Remember guys, the first lap we enter, just make it more of a warm-up pace, you know? We don't want to be full out because uh, we'll end up, you know, breaking traction too quick, okay? Follow me. So just fill the car out, obviously, get your line right this first uh, lap as well. Remember to start recording on a PDR. All right, get those eyes up. One other thing that you want to start doing too, guys, is you know, getting the uh, brain thinking about the next corner, even if you don't see it.
a lot better. Try not to carry so much mid-corner speed through these big corners. Slow the mid-corner speed down. There you go. You can only do what your tires will let you do. So, in turn you over there, it seems like you're trying to carry a lot of speed through the middle. Remember, keep yourself in check through here. This is just purely setting up so we can get a good run and out of here. Oh, 
Looking left into four. Watch my line. Balancing all the way down to the apex. A little wide there. Stay off that throttle. Turn a little bit tighter next time. Okay, you might need to balance the brakes a little longer. Looking right. Again, we're just in third gear.
start uh, our cool down lap. So let's slow it down and just keep space between each other so we can get air in the radiator. Good job, guys. Good session. Again, some of the mistakes that are made are just, you know, maybe looking in front of us, turning the wheel too fast here and there. So remember, have a plan. As you're approaching each corner, think about that next turn. Think about the speed we need to move the wheel. Think about the speed we're coming off the brake pedal. Um, you know, think about the timing of when it's time to, to get on the throttle. Add more steering. You know, don't stop your hands just because you got to the curb at the apex. Turn a little tighter if you need to. You know, turn more right at that apex point. Uh, if you find yourself on the wrong trajectory uh, at that point. corner with no braking, but that's why we keep our speed slower. here you can stop recording if you want and then uh, what we're going to do is park our cars and get ready for lunch we're going to go to the van get you guys all up to lunch just kind of think about some of the things i was telling you guys work with for the next session if you found yourself getting to the apex curb a little soon you know just slow the hands down you're just turning a little quick uh, if we were losing a little bit of grip here and there just you know our goal is to maintain as much grip as we can and, you know we're going to get a little rotation here and there but we just don't want a lot of rotation. We don't want that car to slide too much on us. So um, just keep adjusting to help that out. 